Hi, Chuck Breer of Here at Chain, Vice President of Strategic Alliances here in Waukegan, Illinois. In terms of the numbering system, there are several things that we have beyond oversized roller in terms of material. Is usually letter designation at the end of the chain. Example, SS is stainless steel. Stainless steel is used in high temperature applications, wash down applications where you see stainless steel machinery and red brick floors, chances are you're gonna be working with and working on a stainless chain. So it's always gonna end in an SS. If it's a heavy application, it takes more than the standard 50 or the standard 60, we have what we call a designation H, which means heavy. In, in essence, the sidebars are a little heavier, a little thicker, so it can, it can handle a heavier load, or it could handle an impact load if it's, a, if it's a heavy series. So there are chains that are specifically designed and a family of the products on roller chain designed to help and extend the life of the chain in a given application. We also have NP, nickel plate. You also have what we call hollow pin. Hollow pin chains are designed for people to be able to put attachments into chain at varying spacing. I showed you this chain earlier with an attachment. You can imagine this being a chain with a hollow pin and somebody can take a pin link and place that pin link wherever they want in the hollow pin and adjust their spacing. Many OEMs will, machine designers, will want to have some flexibility in terms of their design in particular for packaging. So in the packaging industry, hollow pin chain is a very popular chain because you can simply insert the attachment wherever you need it based on the size of your package and what you're trying to move or convey.